For the first time in more than a year, fans were allowed back inside the Brewers ballpark. They had plenty to cheer about this opening day. Delaney Bry shows us how the crew battled back for a walk off win. When we look back on opening day 2021, it's going to be wins across the board. With a step back to normal, 12,000 fans entered American Family Field to watch the Milwaukee Brewers put together a walk-off win over the Minnesota Twins that was well worth the wait. If you were a fan who made it to the top of the seventh inning and then just completely lost it when the Minnesota Twins went up 5-2, to two, I don't blame you. But if you were able to stay to the bottom of the ninth, you stuck it out and you're a true fan and you got to see something special. Christian Yelich, deep single to right. That would score Colton Wong. Travis Shaw comes up and clutch double to right center. That would score both Hira and Yelich to tie it up at 5-5. Here we are going into extra innings on opening day. And it doesn't take long for the crew to have a reason to celebrate. Orlando Arcia puts it in play. Fielder's choice. Kane has scored. It's a walk-off win for the Milwaukee Brewers, 6-5 to five over the Minnesota Twins. You want to celebrate a walk-off with the fans, you know. Um, it just makes it more exciting. Um, just the whole thing was just, just awesome to have the fans back. So uh, I'm, I'm definitely excited to, to uh, you know, definitely pack the house. The Brewers will have Friday to enjoy this win, and then it's back to business as they host the Minnesota Twins Saturday and Sunday in their opening series. Delaney Bry, TMJ4 News. Delaney, thank you. With just 25% capacity allowed inside American Family Field, hundreds of employees who work game days at the ballpark remain laid off. Beer vendors like Ryan Sternad are being told summer could be the earliest they get to return. And it really hurts because a lot of us vendors save that money. We save about half of it year round, save the other half more off for the off season. So that money can go into our mortgage payments, our car payments, even sending our kids to school. No tailgating allowed outside of the ballpark, at least to start the season, which means big business for nearby bars and restaurants. Crowds packed J&B's Blue Ribbon Bar and Grill on Blue Mound to full capacity for today's game. We got to start a lot earlier today. My wife and I, we came from uh, two and a half hours away.